Misty and Busy presents Quick Tips for the Everyday Busy User. Quick Keys. So if you go into System, Quick Keys, it's very possible to be able to go in and create your Quick Keys. So for any command, common commands that you use, for example, solid, auto constraint, you can assign this as a quick key to quickly access it without having to go through the pull downs. It would speed up your process in regards to get to the command and speed up your process ultimately for doing a design. So for example, you can set these to a normal key, control plus a key, shift plus a key, and alt plus a key. So in this example, we're going to do alt A as our shortcut for auto constraint. This requires a restart of Visi, so when you close out and reopen up Visi, you press Alt A, and that will load in the auto constraint command. It's possible to add in as many common quick keys as you want for your day to day process to speed everything up. So if you're a person that likes to use quick keys, hit a button, gets to a command. This is a very fast way of being able to do that. So as you can see, these quick keys are based on the drop downs for assigning, and this allows you to assign those quick keys. Fast context menu. Very similar to the quick keys is this fast context wheel menu. So you can get to commands very easily through this wheel. So under system, right hand menu, it's possible to control this. You go to the middle tab called fast context, and you can control how many commands are in here, whether it's 4, 8, or 16. Just like with quick keys, it's also possible to assign this to a normal, which is just your sliding bar, control, shift, or alt in here. So for this example, I'm going to use eight commands. I'll expand this down, and let's say I add auto constraint to this. So I'll set this up as command one, and unlike the other commands, this does not require a restart. If I wanted to, I can assign quick keys to the control area as well. So for example, my consolidated commands, I can assign delete and heal and extract faces, separating those commands out. So if I hit OK, I can easily get to the separated consolidated command. So here's auto constraint. Let's say I draw a block. I use the control key to get to my other menu. Here's delete and heal. You can see how it says delete and heal instead of delete extract faces. And here is extract, using the control key once again. You can see how it just says extract faces. Icons. There is a way that you can customize all these icons at the very top part of your menu, as well as the icons on the left. This is all done through the System Icons dropdown. Within here, the very top area, is your icons, like as if you were defining them through the pull downs at the very top here. Down at the bottom are your custom areas. So if I right click here, I can set this as a non-transparent group. This non-transparent group will show up on the left side and also give you the option to show up at the top. A toolbar group is only going to show up on the very top when you add it. So we're going to set this as a non-transparent group, giving it a name. And inside of here, you scroll down to that group, you highlight it, then you find your common command. For example, solid auto constraint. And we'll also add a plane from closed area. We'll go to copy, we'll find that group, and go to paste. So within here, you can paste a group, paste outside the group, and now this is pasted in that group. Hitting the save button at the very top will allow you to save these. You can also add or remove other commands as well. So if we select save, you'll see that icon show up on the left side. You can see the groups of items inside of that icon area. Then you can also tab through your bars, right click, and you can add that icon here. You can add and remove icons as you want to. We can also add our own custom tab in here as well. So we can rename that tab, give it a custom name. And then we can also add that option as well as other options in there to customize our process. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe for more videos. If you have any questions or would like to see a live demo, please contact us at 248-922-1000.
9293 or by visiting our website at tst-software.com.